Hello YouTube and welcome to the comic book channel. Today I'm actually, today is Thursday, but I'm going to do, sorry, Tuesday, <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and do my comic book pickups uh, early because I haven't had a chance to read anything yet and yes I do have my comic books um, for some reason or another. Uh, it's a pretty big haul so I'm not going to spend too much time on them because every time I make a video over 15 minutes long YouTube hates me and it doesn't want to let me publish it. So I'm pretty much just going to go through the books. Uh, starting off I got the DC Nation issue number two, the little inside DC magazine. Um, some uh, Batman 50 insider stuff on there with the wedding and whatnot. Um, got the True Believers, Fantastic Four. Uh... Sorry, what is on this one? <laughs> oh, it's the wedding of Sue and Reed. <laughs> Sorry, I did not even know what this one was. Um, but yeah, got that one. Um, we're seeing some uh, solicits for the Dan Slott, uh, Sarah Pacelli, Fantastic Four, the return of the Fantastic Four there. Um, also got the True Believers Fantastic Four, the Coming of Galactus issue there. Um, so that's pretty cool. Those dollar reprints are always great. Um, got Spawn, the, uh, I, I believe this is the B cover, and this is 287 B cover there. Um, or that might be the A cover, and maybe the Matina is the B cover. I don't know. Either way. There's the other cover, the Matina cover. I really like this cover a lot. It's great. Um, so there's those. I, of course, got my Valiant High number three because I love this book. It's super fun, um, and I think it would be cool. Um, also, there is something going on with Faith, so that looks cool. That comes in September, Faith Dreamside. Pretty cool. Um, but, yeah, Valiant High number three. Um... Got Spider-Man vs. Deadpool number 35. It's a really cool cover there. like what they have going on with that one. The Truth About the Parkers. Yes. It sounds fun. Um, got my uh, 181, Walking Dead 181 with Glenn on the cover there. Bill Sinkavage B cover. It's a really nice cover. All of his have been really nice. But I like that one especially. Um, got my Star Wars 50 here. Really like that cover a lot too. I'm gonna like a lot of these covers, I guess. Um, it's a really cool cover. This is a cool cover, but a crazy cover. Um, this is Unnatural number one. This is the B cover for that. Some some craziness going on there. Um, I'll be excited to read this book. It sounds very interesting. I don't know how well it'll do, but it sounds cool. There's the A cover for that one. Um, got Weapon X number 20 here. Weapon X is always fun. Always a fun book to read. X-Men Gold number 31, the aftermath of the wedding or whatever happened. Um, Marvel Rising Squirrel Girl and Miss Marvel number one. So that first, uh... Alpha issue was cool, and the Zero issue was cool, so that will be cool too, I'm sure. Um, here's the A cover for Nightwing 46. Sorry, I'm off center there. Uh, from Mr. Brian K. Vaughn, we have Paper Girls number 22. This is a cool book if you're not reading it. It's really fun. Brian K. Vaughn's a really good writer, obviously. Uh, we have the Tencent Project Superpower Zero Issue from Dynamite. From Image, we have New Lieutenants of Metal, number one. So it's a new number one there. Um, be an interesting book. Okay, there's a few covers for this one. This is one of 12, and this is Jim Henson's Beneath the Dark Crystal. I don't know which cover this is. It doesn't say. But it does say pre-order on the back, which is weird. I don't know what that means. Um, I wonder if they all say that. No, they don't. Hmm. Odd. Uh, here's another cover of that one. And 
Oh, this is an unlocked retailer variant of the same book. Beneath the Dark Crystal, number one. Uh, the B cover for Nightwing 46. It's a really nice cover. Really nice. Justice League number three, New Justice, A cover. And the B cover. There's just a lot of books this week. Uh, this is Low Life number one. Low Lives number one. Low Lifes. You know what I mean. I can't talk. Uh, we have Infinity Countdown Champions in number two. Got some Thanos action on the cover there. It's pretty awesome. And a book that I'm really stoked about. The Immortal Hulk number two. The Alex Ross cover there. I'm really excited to read this. I wish I did not have to go to bed after I made this video because I would read it. But I can't till tomorrow. Then we have, from Jeff Lemire, The Quantum Age, number one. So this is the, uh, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's the, it's like the spinoff book from Black Hammer. Um, and I don't know what this is. It just came with my books. Lady McKenna. Makina? Machina? I don't know. I don't know how you say that. Um, but this is like a... I don't know. It has like a uh, subtitle or something. I, I don't know what it is. Got my Rocco's Modern Life number 6 subscription cover there. It's a cool cover. Got my Rocco's Modern Life number 6 regular cover. Okay, and here's where it gets crazy. Got my Captain America number one, regular cover. And this cover. Sorry, I don't even know who these covers are by. I guess I should, but I don't. Um, got Astonishing X-Men number 13 here. And a new number one from DC Comic Books, Catwoman number one. This meta issue with Batman number 50 on the cover of Catwoman number one. I got the Stanley Art Germ Catwoman number one. Very nice cover there. I have Batman 50, this cover. I think that's the C cover, maybe. I know this is the A cover. Batman 50. Um, I'm not sure which cover this is, but I have this one too. <laughs> I have Ben Riley, the Scarlet Spider, number 21. A really jacked up uh, Avengers number four Carol Danvers variant cover with a nice long fold all the way up the cover. Super excited about that. Sorry, I ended up with a few doubles in here that I did not mean to end up with. I'll take those out. Hmm. Sorry about that. Uh, I'm going to read Selly's number two for some odd reason. I'm hoping that there was some kind of point behind that first issue, I guess. Don't know. We'll find out. Um, I, of course, got the variant of Cosmic Ghost Rider number one. And the regular cover of Cosmic Ghost Rider number one. I have another jacked up comic, uh, Hunt for Wolverine Weapon Loss number three with a nice fold there. 
So thank you for that. Um, maybe one day I'll learn how to use a press. I can fix these things, kind of. Got Dark Arc, number eight. Got Harley Quinn, number 45. Got the B cover on that one. <clears throat> Got a really nice looking Deathstroke, number 33 there. Really like that cover a lot, it's very nice. Very nice, very nice. Got the Doctor Strange 3 Carol Danvers variant. It's a great looking cover as well. We're almost there, we're getting close. We have I Hate Fairyland number 20, this cover. And the Fuck Fairyland cover. We have this cover, who I cannot remember who it's by. This is cover D, but I don't remember who did it. This is cover C, which I equally do not know who did this cover. Um, this is cover F. This is a very nice cover. I like this one a lot. Here's Green Lanterns number 50. Variant cover there, the B cover, right? Yes. We're making it through. Uh, got Green Lanterns number 50 regular cover. It's also a nice cover there. I have Green Arrow number 42 regular cover. Really cool, crazy looking cover there. Um, also have the uh, variant cover on that one, which is the... Uh, I felt like I remembered who did this cover, but now I don't. I don't see, like, I don't recognize the signature. It's a cool cover either way. I have Final Street number one. I have Go Go Power Rangers number 11, got the uh, B cover there, or subscri subscription cover, however you say it. I'm hoping that I will find the Mallrats homage cover somewhere on eBay or something. Um, we have Deadpool number 2. Have Death of the Inhumans number 1, this is a Young Guns variant. Medusa on the cover there. It's an awesome cover. Um, we also have the Javier Jaren, Jaren variant cover for that one. Young Guns variant. One's pretty cool. I like the other one better, but that one's cool. And we have the regular cover here. I think that's the regular cover. Yes, it is. The regular cover is really awesome. I like that a lot. Also have this, uh, I believe this was an incentive cover for Death of the Inhumans one. Should put that in a different pile. <laughs> uh, Gaidico? Gaidico? I don't know how you say this one. Uh, I saw this solicited, but I'm not too sure what it is. So, is that Gaidico, I believe? And another Death of the Inhumans uh, variant cover. This is the... Uh, I forget what these variants are called, but that's this cover. And those are the books. And like I said, I want to keep this under 15 minutes so YouTube does not try to kill me putting up the video. So those are my pickups for the week. Uh, please let me know in the comments below what you guys picked up. If this is your first time here and you like what you see, please subscribe. Um, like I said, leave a comment, leave a thumbs up if you can, and I think that's it. I'm out. See you guys tomorrow.